Boston University men's soccer returned home from a three-game road trip to open Patriot League play against American. A physical match between the Eagles and Terriers went scoreless into the 42nd minute when Satchel Corte broke the scoreless tie with his first goal of the year. For the Terriers, to the wing it goes, Butsky now. Can he slice it in front? Yes, he can! Beautiful feed, against Solage. No correction, Satchel Corte lays it in and it's 1-0 BU. The junior midfielder from Pennington, New Jersey gave BU a 1-0 lead on assists by Kerry Peterson and Peter Cardbo. BU doubled its lead during the 60th minute on a strike from Austin, Deanna. American is winless in its last five matches. And here's a giveaway, Deanna. Cardbo sent it ahead. Deanna now on the doorstep, and Deanna scores. Our player to watch for BU makes it a 2-0 lead over American. Called upon to fill in. The sophomore forward from Hernando, Florida, tallied his second goal in as many games, and TJ Butsky picked up his second helper of the year. American answered just two minutes later after a foul in the box by BU. Eagles leading scorer Fabio Massaro stepped to the penalty spot and cut the Terrier lead two to one. The Eagles nearly equalized in the closing minutes, but senior goalkeeper Mike Bernardi made electrifying saves to keep BU in front. The Terriers held on for a 2-1 victory on Saturday in the Patriot League opener over American at Nickerson Field. A busy home week continues on Tuesday night at 7 when the Terriers step out of conference to host Brown. I'm Kevin Gale joined by BU senior goalkeeper Mike Bernardi after a 2-1 victory in the Patriot League opener over American. And Mike, this was one heck of a battle. You had to make some great saves down the stretch to hold on to this win. How did it feel to open up Patriot League play like this? Oh, it's no better feeling, you know. We knew coming in today that it, it was a new season. We started off 0-0 today, and we're happy to get three points. I'm just happy to be able to do my part. It's been a bit of a battle for that goalkeeping starting spot between you and William Bonalica. Both of you have done some tremendous work this year, but 14 saves against Princeton, more than anybody else in college soccer this year, and then a performance like this here today. What would you say has been the difference for you the last couple weeks? Well, you know, Will and I, we have a really good relationship. We're always pushing each other to be the best, and. You know, we, we wish nothing but the best for each other, but, you know, I think that, you know, I was given an opportunity in that game against Princeton, and I made the most of it, and I'm just trying to build on that confidence, you know, believe in myself, have a little bit of faith in God, and I think I'll be okay. I know you guys wanted a few more wins in non-conference play, but these are the wins that matter. What was the difference today defensively from your back line? Yeah, no, today um, we, we came out focused, and we were going to take the game to them. You know, it was on our home field on a beautiful Saturday afternoon, and we decided, you know, we're not going to sit back. We're going to take the game to them. And, we're going to make them earn it. And, you know, thankfully today we came out on top. Well, congratulations, 1-0 in Patriot League play. Thank you. Appreciate it. With BU men's soccer head coach Neil Roberts after a thrilling 2-1 victory over American to open Patriot League play. Neil, it's never easy in conference play. Yeah. Mike Bernardi, your starting goalkeeper, made some tremendous saves yeah. to keep you guys in front. And Mike did. You know, we uh, it got kind of hectic. Uh, you know, after we went up two nothing, unfortunately, and uh, give them credit, they play. You know, they 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 came at us and kept coming at us. Mike did a good job. You know, the backs did the best they could, but uh, uh, we we left them exposed a couple times. And it's tough to know what your team's going to bring to the pitch, especially when you lose your leading scorer, Matt McDonald. But Austin Deanna has now scored two goals in his last two matches, yeah. starting at the top of your formation. You've got to be impressed by that. Yeah, he's coming along. He's not. He's not. He's hopefully by the end of the year. He'll be, he'll be a, a really quality striker. He's working real hard. Uh, he's, you know, he can strike a ball really well, but uh, he's got work to do, but he's working hard, so. And it must be satisfying for the first time this year to see your defense and your goalkeeper, and everyone for that matter, hold on to a late lead. <laughs> yeah, well, we tried not to, but they did. Uh, they, they fought hard, they, and they fought hard all year, you know, and, uh, you know, again, we still got to, to help their legs, we've got to get some possession going, but we just don't seem to have that right now. But hopefully, hopefully we will before long. Well, congratulations on a 1-0 start in Patriot League play. Thank you.